I don't even have a shirt on. You can't put this on YouTube. Really? How you doing, buddy? Yeah. Where's Seth? Inside, of course. What, is he sleeping? No, he's not sleeping, but he's not fully awake either. Oh. Uh, so what's the plan? I'm gonna go brush hogging. You're gonna do a little brush hogging? How are you girls doing today? I made a grass track loop. A grass track loop? Yeah, follow just the brush out the path. All right. The guys are trying out the grass track. Jake took over my bike. Seth's been rocking it quite good. This is something I'm definitely not used to. This is what uh, Seth and Jake see a lot of the races, so it's good to kind of make your own track and, and ride it. This one's pretty tricky. At least it's most, the most difficult for me. I wrecked right there. Let's see how Jake takes it. Maybe I'm giving it too much throttle. We've already developed a few berms throughout the track. And that definitely helps with the turning and speed throughout the turn. This track could really turn into something if we just kept right riding it. Seth almost went down. I hope he went down. <laughs> you good? That corner is tough. Maybe I should give these guys an incentive, including myself, by doing like a trial run or, or like a timed race. So you can make the best lap time. I think that'll be fun. You want to do a trial run? Like, see who can get the best time? <laughs> I'm not very quick at this, but that's pretty good at shaking these corners. Yeah, he is. I haven't. I never could catch up to him. He's got a really nice tire in the back, too, though. Does he? Yeah, this one slips and slides. Yeah, I see that. Let's see what you can do for a time. Alright, I guess. I'm gonna, let's see if I know how to work this thing. I'm these flip flops are quite nice. Yeah? Yeah, the, the pad is right where I need to shift, so everything's good. Okay, do you want to do a dead start or do you want to do a running start? Is your bike gonna start up nice? Probably not. Let's just do a running start. Ready, set, go! Oh, I already took turn uh, three pretty fast. He's at 12 seconds. All right, giving it some juice around that straight edge. Right here, you can give it some throttle, but you can't really uh, get traction. He got 28.85. Let's see if Seth wants to do it. Hey, Jake just did the thing in 28 seconds. You want to see if you can beat him? Set, go. You got 28.85. Seth's going to try it right now. I beat him. Okay, 11 seconds, he's about at the same spot. Come on, Seth, you got this. I think he's getting a little nervous this race. He was doing better before. He might get you, though. Oh, 24, 25, 26, 27. What is that, 1.6 behind? 1.6 seconds, is that the math? 1.6 seconds behind, my turn. Jake got 28.85, Seth got 30.2, my turn. There he goes! That was a good corner there. You see that? He's going quick. Yeah. 
hirenpiirossa. He beat you though. Point seven seconds. Jake, earlier this week you had some bad news. Yeah. Guess what? It's finished. Now you got good news. Yeah. Really good news because the price is good, right? Yep. When the price is good, that's when it's really good. His bike is uh, his bike blew up, but now it's it's ready to go. We're gonna go pick it up right now. We're taking my truck to go pick up Jake's bike. We're also gonna stop in town and get some water. I'm I'm dying of thirst. Where's the There's Steve. <laughs> we saw Steve. Yeah. We're gonna go grab some water. We saw Mr. Steve on the way back. Uh, He's awesome. We gotta have him in the videos more often. I got water. Jay's gonna grab the other one. He's getting deodorant too. There's his bike. Promise me no promises. Easy! Hey. Jake, are you excited about the new bike? Okay. Look at the rig. He's putting a four-wheeler on. Are you pumped? I'm excited. We made it back to Jake's. We're working on Seth's bike. Jake's working on Seth's bike. Jake's Jake's a good handyman, I guess. Uh, Seth, Seth ended up uh, scoring a foot peg pretty cheap from Dave. So not only did Dave help us out there, but Dave also saved Jake like big time because he blew up his bike Tuesday, did we, did we say? He blew up on Sunday. Sunday, I dropped it off on Tuesday. Tuesday and got it back today on Friday. And they, they gave Jake an extremely good deal. So they definitely saved him. Um, it's awesome. Very, very cool. So Jake's gonna be ready for the race. Seth's getting more dialed in for the race. You got an air filter as well too, Seth, right? I did. So Seth wants to be artsy fartsy. Seth, show him what you want to do. I came up with an idea. Um, if you want to send us use sprockets, front and rear, small and big. We're gonna put them on the wall and kind of make a cool art project. Eventually have enough to cover the wall. Kind of like I did with the license plates? Yeah. Please, no. So if anybody's got sprockets, my uh, P.O. box will be in the description. Yes. Used, I mean. Used or new, you know, if the new ones we could put yeah, them on, put them to use, use, and then we can install them on the wall. Sounds way better. Look at that beautiful sky. Very, very beautiful. I don't even have a shirt on. You can't put this on YouTube. Really? Oh, it's smoke. Uh, look at they're gonna call me fat. We went riding, we're gonna have a little bit of ficken or chish. It's the, it's the fish or the chicken that looks like fish that we had the other day. Oh! Seth's putting in a little practice after he just got done washing his bike. We ended up making a single track, which was kind of cool. And we actually beat it in pretty good considering that it was only like a couple hours old. How you doing, Seth? Come on, it smells like dog poop. It's your back tire, Jake. I watched it. Seth treats his bike a little better than Jake and I do. He was the only one who washed his bike. Jake and I just, let me put him away. Oh, it's pretty my, my bike is running better though, which is really good. What were you gonna say, Jake? My bike's pretty clean. It is. There's no mud it's, down here at it's all. It's very classy. I agree. Yeah. Mine isn't too dirty either. Yeah. Seth, you must have just been mud bogging. Seth likes the mud. I don't like the mud. I think you like the mud. Should we end the vlog here or should we show them the fish or the the ficken? No, they don't want to see that. They don't want to see the ficken. The ficken's kind of nasty. Jake, what are you doing out there? Water in the grass. <laughs> Let's show them the, the chish or the ficken. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. When I was running the drone and Jake and Seth were going around the second track, our, our main track, uh, Jake actually found a turtle and saved him. <laughs> Unfortunately, the turtle didn't really like Jake. Yeah, I picked the turtle up. I was gonna go put him in a safe location. He whizzed all over my hands. Well, with gloves actually, but still. What the heck? Did you kind of like that or 
No. Was it refreshing at all? No. Oh. Power Rangers! <laughs> Where are we putting them? On the wall. <laughs> wall. This one, maybe. You can always take them down. Anyway, here's the idea. We're not going to put it on the cement wall, but... Why not? Because how are you gonna, what are you going to construction a piece of it? Uh, you probably could just put it on where we could spice one of those, those little Velcro things and just. <laughs> oh, holy frick, that's expensive. How about we put it on a wooden wall? So I could get rid of that. You ain't got a lot of wood in here, buddy. <laughs> I can get rid of this tire here and we can put them right there. Yeah, I, I agree. Guess.